we are looking at the 2024 Hearth and Hand Spring line. Well, this would make a really, really great bed tray. But I have to say, these milk glass items are gorgeous in person. This is a really unique piece for this collection. Lots of options here for mini plants. Hello everyone, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. Today we are looking at the 2024 Hearth and Hand Spring line in person. If you missed it, I did do a shopping the collection video online and I was pretty like disappointed in the collection overall. There are lots of really great pieces, but online I felt like it was a really hard collection to shop because there's so many items. There's items for like every single area of your home and it just felt very scattered to me so I'm really interested in shopping this collection in person actually being able to like see touch and feel all the items and give you a better idea of the collection let you know the hits the misses in my opinion but I'm really excited to jump in there's so many new items so we're gonna jump in right now the hearth and hand section is absolutely packed with all brand new items. Like everywhere I look, there's all new stuff. We're actually gonna start right here in these boxes. I did try to unbox one of these, but there's just too many parts that have like tape that need to be unboxed with like a box cutter. But I wanted to be able to show you this lamp. So hopefully we can head to another Target and I'll be able to show it to you in this video. But this is a really, really pretty dark green like plaid lamp shade. And then it does have really beautiful like dark brass accents. Hopefully I can show it to you in all of its glory. This just like feels feels like more of a fall lamp to me let me know if you guys feel the same way it just doesn't like scream spring or new year's it feels very like i guess winter which technically it is but this is technically a spring collection and this just feels more fall christmas to me but let me know your thoughts anyways i think it's really pretty it just like I feel like to me it doesn't really go with the collection. Here is another dark green item. This is a canvas mail sorter. This is $19.99. It's dark green and brass. It like perfectly matches the lamp that we were just looking at. So they do kind of have that going. But again, I don't know. It just feels very dark to me for a spring collection. A lamp that's new that I do really like is this pleated lamp shade table lamp. And this is like the white pleated shade. And then it's this beautiful brass lamp that has like so many fun details. This is $59. 99 I definitely prefer this over the other lamp there is also a third lamp that I'm on the hunt for but I really do like this one the pleated lampshade has really grown on me tons of new items on this shelf first off being the fluted planters and this does come in I think three different sizes this is the small this is $14.99 and then here is the larger size I believe this is $50 this is, yeah, $49.99, and there may also be a mid-size. I'm really interested in getting this. We have so many plants that have outgrown our planters from last year, and I just want to get them a nice big one that they can kind of flourish and thrive in. Right above that are two new items, and these kind of feel almost like paper mache type items. This is the Artesian Handcrafted Oval Tray. And this actually is very, very pretty. I won't lie, I really do like this in person. Didn't really love it online. It was hard to tell what the size was. And I think this feels nice. It does have a good weight to it. And it feels very handcrafted, like paper mache almost. And then here is the bowl. It's like a really, really pretty ivory color. This is $24.99. And again, I really do like this. I think it's pretty for a decor stack or a small fruit bowl in your kitchen. Here are the first two of the artificial plants in this collection. This is the tabletop arrangement. It's like the wildflower setum arrangement. There's like purples and yellows and greens in this fluted blood, uh, blood vase. Oh my goodness. In this fluted bud vase that is like very quintessential for hearth and hand. This is $14.99. And then right here, I like the pot that this one comes in. This is the tabletop arrangement. It doesn't say what kind of plant it is, but I will have everything that I showed today linked down below in the order that I show it. Here is the smaller setum arrangement. This one is $11.99. It just has this like really pretty pink setum. I think this would be really pretty for Bryn's room or some like very subtle Valentine's Day decorating. I do like the super light pink. Just so you can kind of see like size differences here. Let me see if I can get them side by side. This one's definitely larger. This one's $11.99, this one's $14.99. The plants are very different, but I feel like they do mix together and go side by side very well. Here is the first of the new vases for this collection. This first one is like this green sea glass. Comes in three different sizes. This is the smallest one and that is $19.99. I feel like that's kind of crazy price-wise. The next one is $29.99. This is the medium size. And then it does come in this super large version 
me just kind of put this down here so you can like kind of get an idea. This one is massive compared to these two. So it comes in three different sizes. I just think the prices are a little bit wonky. I feel like this one should be maybe 10. This one should be like 25 and then I could see this one being 40, but that's inflation. Here is the next new glass vase. This one is 30. This one also comes in two sizes. It's like a very light, cool toned amber glass. It does come in a shorter version. Hopefully we'll find it today, but this one is $30. Both really pretty. I just prefer like a ceramic opaque style vase as opposed to like a clear see-through vase but that's just me so i wouldn't purchase either of these but i do think they are really pretty you could just can find really really similar items at home goods for so much cheaper this wooden tray is very very nice it's super lightweight this is 34.99 it's super lightweight like if this was more of a solid wood i definitely wouldn't be able to bounce it in my hand like that but i do like the oval size um and the size of it the oval shape and the size the color is pretty as well this would make a really really great bed tray here is the smaller size of the vase we were just looking at it's like small and super super wide it's definitely like a really unique shape this is 24.99 let me show you it like compared to my hand again just like that really beautiful like milk chocolate amber color let me show you the difference so this one's taller but it's not as wide like I don't know if there's gonna be any way I can like really really show you the size difference like this one is massive it's kind of like an awkward size let me know down below what you would do with this vase and right below that there are a few of these smaller arrangements i swear these used to be five dollars they are now 6.99 this is the little like mini daisy and i really do like the pot that this comes in it's like very very just like textured and i like that about it but not a huge fan of the little daisy i feel like they had that in the fall collection and then they have these other small mini plants um, these all have names and I will have them all like linked down below. I do love the soil. This is the mini succulent. And then I think this is like that faux heart plant. Like the name of the actual plant is like something to do with hearts because the little leaves are very like loosely shaped like hearts. So lots of options here for mini plants. Perfect for any like bookshelf or bathroom shelf, kitchen shelf just to add a little fresh pop. Here is another one of the new arrangements. I have seen this one already in person and I really like it. This is the faux dogwood. It's $24.99. I actually feel like it's pretty good for the size. Hearth and hand, sometimes it can just be like so expensive for what you get, but I'm actually a big fan of this arrangement. Here is a bigger arrangement that comes in that same pot that we were just looking at. This is $34.99. I'm not sure if this is also dogwood leaf and just the large size, but I really, really like both of these. I love the pots that these come in and I really do like the dogwood leaf so these are a win for me. Here are some of the new kitchen items. This is the pot holder set. I feel like online it looked more of like an orange but in person it's more of like a camel stripe. This is really pretty. It's cotton and jute. It's $8.99 for the two and I may end up picking this up for our butler's pantry shelves. If you're more into like the long oven mitts they do also have that style and that is $8.99 for one. Moving into the kitchen items, this is one of the items I was most excited about in this collection. It's a marble footed tray and it's really, really pretty. I might pick this up for our kitchen. This is $24.99. I think I'm just gonna put it in my cart because this is the only one that they have and I am a pretty big fan of this. They have a few more pieces that match that warm marble. So this is the first one. This is a marble utensil holder. You guys, this is tiny. This could only hold like maybe a few utensils I maybe I just have like way more utensils than your average bear but this is $24.99 and I was just expecting it to be bigger it is really pretty I do like the marble but this is a miss for me and if you're a fan of that warm marble they do also have these salt and pepper shaker sets it comes with like the little wooden holder on the bottom the salt and pepper and this is $14.99 they do all look a little bit different because it is a natural material so if you prefer a certain look or if you're looking for something specific definitely shop these in person because some of them look very similar like the salt and pepper whereas like these two look very different those two again look really similar so shop this in person if you're looking for something specific
specific. Here are some of the other new cups. I really like this green color. It's really pretty for the spring. It's like a lighter, almost like olive -y sage color. They have these stripe mugs. These are $6.99 a piece, which is a bit much for just one mug. They do also have it in this like glazed stripe version, this espresso cup set. So you get two mugs that stack for $9.99. And they have all of those exact same mugs in this like mauve blush color. And the canisters, like the new canisters in this collection are also this color. And it's definitely really pretty in person. It's like a mauve brown. Online they describe it as a blush. And in person it's definitely more of like a mauve brown color, which I really like. Another win, some that I think are really pretty are these new candles. I love this dark brass lid that comes on them. It comes in all of like the classic Studio McGee scents. This is the salt scent. They also have the bergamot and ivy and canvas. So all of the classic hearth and hand scents but I just think these are so pretty and if you burn through the candle you're gonna be left with a really really gorgeous container it does say like ivy in the glass or whatever but if you turn that around you would never even know so I feel like you get a good item like you, it's kind of like a good two for one and another item that's right here that's really really cute is this little like bunny plush toy. This is adorable. They did have this styled on bookshelves. A lot of you guys might know that I get a little doll for my daughter's bookshelves every season. Typically I buy it from Home Goods though because I like to get the really long legs. But if I can't find one, I'll be coming back for this one for sure because I love the long ears. There are some good kitchen items in this collection I was excited to see in person. Here's one of them. This is the brass and wood paper towel holder. It's like a dark brass, which is really pretty. This is $16.99. It does have these little like grippies on the bottom to help it stay in place. So I'm a fan of that. And there's also a really gorgeous napkin holder that matches it. Here is the napkin holder. This is $12.99 and I really do like this. We have all like light marble stuff, so I'm not going to be like replacing it all. But if I was in the market, this is something I would definitely definitely be interested in and I think the price is pretty good I also just love like the metal arch really really pretty here is the juicer in person this thing is legit this is heavy duty this is so cool this is $29.99 kind of like an old-fashioned juice press Brian if he saw this would be like oh my god we need to get this and make grapefruit crushes at home if you know you know Brian is originally from Maryland and the grapefruit crush is like such a I don't know, statewide staple there. And it's only a real grapefruit crush if you crush a whole grapefruit straight into the drink. So if he saw this, he'd be like, we need to get it. <laughs> kind of makes me want to pick it up just for him. I know he'd be so excited. Um, another new kitchen item that's really pretty are these berry bowls. You do get one of the green. These kind of match the mugs we were just looking at. So like one of the green and then one of the mauve pink. And these are $9.99 for two. They do also have the bigger berry bowl that has the handle and this is in that like mauve brown pink color this is so so pretty and this is $14.99 they do also have this really gorgeous glass pitcher it's the same as the mugs that like green stripe and this is $19.99 these would go really well with the juice press they just would be perfect little like juice glasses these are $3.99 they're just small little glass tumblers they can't be more than like six ounces. Like these are really, really small. They're probably four ounces. So I think it's gonna be perfect little juice glasses and they have it in the mauve pink as well as in this really pretty like tealy green color. They also have the brass and wood Tic Tac Toe set. So if you're really into the brass and wood, they have so many items and this is really fun. There's so many Tic Tac Toe sets I feel like in all these different collections. Also in like Target Dollar Spot, Hobby Lobby always has a lot of the Tic Tac Toe items. This is really pretty. You get all 12 pieces, you get the kit all of the X's and O's you would need to play tic-tac-toe, and this is 30. If you like the hearth and hand toys, I'll just show you this really quick as well. This is the bunny stacker. So really, really cute for Easter. Probably something I'll end up picking up for Bryn's shelves. You guys know I just love a good themed item, and this is $12.99. Another new vase that they have this year is the textured bouquet vase. This is so pretty. I really do like the lines. It kind of reminds me of an artisanal glaze collection that they had from Studio McGee like two or three seasons ago. This is $29.99. Comes in a tall version as well as a shorter version, both perfect for any like real or faux arrangements you wanna make. And the smaller size is $19.99. I really, really like this. See, I just like love this style of vase, like a good opaque, 
creamy vase so pretty here are the two like four by six or these are six by eight floral wall prints these are actually so pretty. These would be so pretty for a shelf or like entryway decorating. If you have built-ins, I think that these would be a really great snag. I love the matting. These are actually so pretty and these are $16.99 for the set. This is a really unique piece for this collection and I am super interested in these. I wanted to see them in person. These are $24.99. They are taper candle holders. So you put a taper candle holder, but it's like so different than any taper candle holder you've seen before. Like for instance, that's another taper candle holder right there from Hearth and Hand. More of like the traditional like candelabra style. But this is so pretty and I just like love the size of it. It's $24.99, my store has three of them. And I think these are really, really gorgeous. And I can think of so many different places I could style these. I am super excited to see this in person. This is the brass pleated wall mirror. And I really, really wanted to see this in person. It is super pretty. My camera's having a hard time because it just wants to like focus on everything that's actually in the mirror um, but here is what that looks like it is really really pretty it comes in two different sizes this is the small size this is the 20 diameter and it also comes in a 30 inch diameter and I think it's like a more unique take on like you're just your basic like entryway round mirror and I'm a I'm a big fan of this one actually. Here are some of the new like office type items like the bookends and these are pretty heavy, solid, nice brass and wood bookends. So those are nice, not really my style. Like I would go more for like the solid brass ones in the Studio McGee collection if I was in the market. But something I do like is this little perpetual desk calendar. Sorry, the overhead lights are like so extreme. But what you do is you just kind of like rotate this through all the days and the months and you can just like use it all year round. I think this is actually really cute. This is $16.99 and I think this would be super nice for a desk. That goes with this desk clock. This feels very lightweight and pretty cheap to me, if I'm honest. Like they do look nice together, but I feel like if you were gonna pick between two, something to like decorate your desk, I would definitely go for the perpetual calendar. Here is the triangle ficus. This is one of the larger trees in the collection. The pot is one that they brought back from last year. I do like the soil in the bottom and the leaves on this are very, very pretty. This is, like I said, the triangle ficus, and this is $119, and this is, I would say, four feet tall. Here is the six-foot tree in this collection. It's pretty. This is the Geisophilia leaf. Definitely one of my favorite, like, faux leaves. I just feel like this is a really good, like, all-year-round plant. It definitely adds in that nice green pop, but, like, it looks pretty realistic, in my opinion. This one is $150. They do also have the new bath items. Of course, this is right next to an in-store scanner. Guys, don't be these people. Don't leave stuff right here they do take a lot of time to like set everything up and it makes it harder to like shop these items but I have to say these milk glass items are gorgeous in person like on camera it's not going to do it justice it's $14.99 this is the milk glass and gold love 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 this is the small size and then they also have the large this one is $19.99 here's the difference between the two I love these they also have these little like milk glass kind of ramekins it's just like a little trinket dish and this milk glass soap dispenser Big, big fan, that is $9.99. I love these new milk glass items. Right here, this is the new like fluted gold waste basket. This is $24.99. And then the brass metal tissue box holder. Again, really sorry to the tissue community if I have upset you. It is really pretty in person. Um, seeing this and kind of like touching this makes me really wish that I could find the mailboxes. I hope that we are able to get our hands on those because they looked really chintzy online. But these feel pretty nice. So hopefully the mailboxes are similar to that. They also have for $20, this is the over the bath um like side bath caddy this is really pretty it's like a really nice brass and then that just goes over the side of your tub and that is twenty dollars perfect for anyone who loves to take baths okay i came to another target this one is so much more organized than the one i was just at 
Look at all of the beautiful glassware. So, so pretty. We've already seen all of these new items, but I just wanted to show you how pretty they are when they are perfectly organized. Here is the mug tree. We have not seen this yet. This is pretty. It just has like the wood base and then the brass matches the paper towel holder and the napkin holder. And this is $19.99. They also have the new like measuring spoons. And I think there's also measuring cups. These are $9.99. I don't know if they come with a ring to like connect them but these are very very nice and I like how they're more squared off and not like rounded I feel like if you were trying to get more precise measurements these are great here are some of the new canisters these are so so pretty this is $19.99 it comes in a short version and a tall so here is the short I actually really really like these but I don't just like to like put canisters on my counter like I feel like I would need to be able to like do something productive with them you could definitely put like k-cups in here that would be really nice what else can I put in here I know they're like a cookie jar technically I'm trying to think could I put like Brin snacks because I really really do like these but like I don't want to put something on my counter unless it is you know functional as well as decorative this is $19.99 oh my gosh this is really really nice here is the lamp in her full glory Let's pull this down and look at it. So it has the brass, and then here is the shade. I think it's really pretty, it'd be so great for an entryway. And it is, in my opinion, very much timeless. But I feel the same way with the out of the box as I did in. It just like doesn't give spring to me at all. But I do think it's really, really pretty. And then here is the taller version. I don't know if I could pick this up with one hand or if I should even try. This one is $22.99, yeah. I don't want to risk breaking it, but this one is really, really pretty as well. It's just a little bit taller than the other one. They would look so great stacked next to each other. And then down here, I actually see a few new table runners that I haven't seen yet. This one is like a really pretty striped. It does have some like cream, kind of like darker cream and blush striping. This is 20 by 90, so this is the oversize and it is jute. And this is $20. I lied, this is $24.99. Then here is another new one. This one's really pretty. It has like really light green striping all throughout. This one again is 20 by 90, so oversized. But they do have the normal lengths here as well. But I always say it's better to get an oversized table runner. These are quite fancy, the oil and vinegar pourers. Doesn't look like they have lids. You get both. These are $7.99. I feel like these are nice to like set a table with, I guess. You could do like dressings. You don't have to use them for oil and vinegar, but you could use these for like dressings. Um, if you like make dressings or something, I don't know, very fancy. What else could you use these for? Maybe like cream and half and half. I don't know. There's lots of things you could do with these little pourers. They are very nice, very fancy. Pinky out. Haven't seen these yet. These are the new linen boxes and they're in a really pretty green color. I actually like these a lot more in person than I did online. The small size is $12.99. They're just like little storage boxes. You can do a ton with these and they're a nice linen material. And then the large one is $16.99 and they're just two really beautiful shades of green. Here is a new bowl that matches like the canisters that I cannot seem to find for whatever reason. The nesting serving bowls with lids. So you get two bowls and and two bamboo lids. This is $39.99. This is like a really nice rib material, which I just really do think I would like the canister so much more in person. This color is so much better in person than it was online. I know I've already said that a few times, but these are very, very nice. Great for like transporting food or like fruit salads. These would be really nice. Look at all the bathroom items at this store. There's no, um, like little scanner right here so you can really really see them yeah these are definitely some of my favorite items from this collection and i found the little petal tray i'm so excited about this this is 4.99 i'm definitely gonna pick this up just to keep in the kitchen so i have somewhere to put my ring because i've just been kind of like putting it down on the counter way across the side of the kitchen from the sink i don't know i'm just like so scared but this is so cute i love this and they were just like right down here i've been searching for this one item so i'm definitely picking this up but i have to say i am very tempted by these here is the little toothbrush dish i just love these so much i really want to pick these up for our guest bathroom they have new stanley items from hearth and hand this is the new stanley quencher this is pretty i think this is in the like sour cream color and i do love my stanleys but i am just I'm an ice flow girl. I like the one that has the top handle. They do also have these new like to-go food jars with hearth and hand, these leak proof bowls in a bunch of different colors. I think there's also like a green colorway. 
So if you're loving Stanley products, they have some new ones with Hearth and Hand and these went fast last time. Well, all right, everybody, there you have it. Pretty much the entire new 2024 Hearth and Hand spring line. I definitely like a lot of the items in person, but I feel like even still the collection, I, I do like it. It's not that I dislike it. I just dislike the experience of shopping it online. It just felt very like all over the place. But I will say a lot of the items are nice in person and I like some of the colors more in person than they showed online. So that's why I just love doing like my first impressions versus like actually shopping the items in stores. And it's all in good fun. I don't ever mean to offend anyone. I know that people like there's like a big divide between like people who love Studio McGee versus Hearth and Hand and I honestly really do love both collections. I feel like they're so different and I love items from both. Like they're both a mix of my style. So that is the new collection. Let me know your thoughts down below. Do you like it more now that I shopped it in person? Have you shopped it in person? Let me know if you picked anything up and thank you guys so much for being here. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button down below as well as the notification bell. I love you guys all so much and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.